Now, let me discuss about another group of drugs that is opioid analgesics. Remember, these are the substances which are obtained from crude extract of papaver somniferum. Right? These are derived from the crude extract of papaver somniferum. So this papaver somniferum it is a poppy plant. Right? This is a poppy plant. So this is a crude extract of the papaver somniferum which is a poppy plant. Now if you take the, among all these opioid analgesics morphine right so remember this particular morphine this is considered as the prototype. So morphine is considered as the prototype opioid right and this morphine it is having the analgesic effect by acting on certain receptors right so this morphine it has agonistic action by acting on the following receptors right this particular morphine it acts on mu kappa and delta receptors right this morphine it is having the analgesic effect or morphine is having the agonistic effect on the following receptors that is mu kappa and as well as delta now let me tell you what will happen if the mu receptors are stimulated once the mu receptors are stimulated the individual will have sedation right that is excessive drowsiness or sleepiness next the individual will have analgesia that is pain will be reduced next constipation is another important effect because of the stimulation of the mu receptors the other important thing is the respiratory depression right next truncal rigidity right truncal rigidity and as well as the constriction of the pupil which is called meiosis and as well as euphoria and as well as euphoria so these are the effects because of the stimulation of the mu receptors that is sedation analgesia constipation respiratory depression truncal rigidity constriction of the pupil that is meiosis and as well as euphoria now what will happen if the kappa receptors are stimulated if kappa receptors are stimulated the individual will have the psychomimetic effects and that particular psychomimetic effects that includes dysphoria right psychomimetic effects which include dysphoria and the other effects because of the stimulation of the kappa are constipation and as well as analgesia right and as well as analgesia so these are the effects because of the stimulation of the kappa receptors next due to stimulation of the delta receptors due to stimulation of the delta receptors the individual will have spinal analgesia right the individual will have spinal analgesia modulation of the hormone and as well as the nortriptyline release is caused by the stimulation of the delta receptors right so modulation of hormone release right so these are the effects by stimulation of mu kappa and delta and morphine it acts as agonist on all these three receptors mu receptors kappa receptors and delta receptors so by stimulation of mu sedation analgesia constipation respiratory depression truncal rigidity meiosis and euphoria and by stimulation of kappa receptors there will be psychomimetic effects that is your dysphoria constipation and analgesia and even by the stimulation of delta receptors the individual will have this particular analgesic property so an important point what i want to tell you is morphine when it is acting on any of these receptors 
इट विल कॉज द एनालिसिक इफेक्ट 